Welcome guys. So we have this question that we are supposed to work out or simplify. Okay, so when you look at this, this is uh, algebra. So by simplifying, we are saying you need to identify the like terms, put them or collect them together. Then you simplify them. That is what we are supposed to do here. All right. So what do I mean? So if you look at this, we have three Y here. All right. The other one is e minus 4y, then plus y. Okay? These are like terms here. And then we also have minus y squared plus 7y squared minus 9y squared. Okay? So when you look at these, these are like terms as well as these are like terms okay so it depends on how you want to work them out all right it depends on how you want to work them out i hope you get what i mean so if we can go it slowly or step by step we when you deal with the first two here you know that you're going to have minus y plus y for these ones here it will be minus y 3y minus 4y it will be minus y then the other side when i work out the first two here which is minus y squared plus 7y squared this is going to give me plus 6y squared then minus 9y squared all right again these are still like terms these are also like terms here so now these, when you look at them, these are opposites of each other. So we are going to have a zero here. We're going to have a zero. And then this other side, when you look at this, we have, it's the same as six minus nine. What do we get? This is going to give us a minus C, three. So this is going to be minus three Y squared. All right. This is what we're going to have. Now, from this point, of course, you know that 0 minus 3y squared, this can better be written as minus 3y squared. Minus 3y squared, this is what is going to be our answer. And if we haven't missed anything, this is the correct final answer. Thank you very much for watching.